Welcome back, guys. It's Drew Beer for breakfast. Facts for snacks. Look at my little... Hey. Weird. It's my wiener dog popping out of nowhere. <laughs> Anyways. All right. I got I got myself... A... All right. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right. I got myself... I, I've been uh, kind of, uh, you know, wanting one, so I'm going to do it. And it's a... It's a porter. It's a porter. And it's uh, from Big Rig Brewery. And you guys are like, oh, my God, you're doing that right now. Yeah, yeah, well... I don't know how my, how well it aged or anything, but it's a, uh, <clears throat> for love of beer, it's Tales from the Patch Pumpkin Porter. Now I have an issue because I for, totally forgot about this beer. Wanted to do it like November-ish. And this was brewed uh, September 2nd of last year. We're looking at eight months, okay? I don't know if this ages at all or if this is going to be nothing but chunk. And it's going to be either a good or bad review. I don't know. But when it comes out again uh, in, say, August and September of this year, I will have to review it right away for you guys. Uh, that will be a revisit. The good thing about this can, though, too, is if you're in the mid uh, pitch black, this can lights up. It glow it's a glow-in-the-dark can. Cool. Anyways, uh, Tales from the, the Patch is chocolate-hued pumpkin porter that uses real pumpkins to brew Team picked from Miller's Farm in Manitoc, Ontario. Cool. Miller's Farm. Hey, say hi. Say hi. Mm. Um, we came back to the brewery and spiced them and baked them. Then put the roasted pumpkin right into the brew. Uh, Big Rig Brewmaster explains. Uh, cool. Let's see LCBO untapped and let's get into this and see if it's bad or not. $3.20 for us. Uh, this offering big rig is a pumpkin porter, hand-picked pumpkins, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, um, the, with aromas of pumpkin, nutmeg, cola, and cinnamon. Flavors of brown sugar, root beer, and vanilla lead to full-bodied and flavorful palate, ending with rich and creamy finish. $3.20, there, guys. I want to see what's on tap, and then we will get into this. Um, it's, it's warm out there, I'm telling you. It is a warm. Come on now. Let's see, untapped. No. All right, all right, untapped. What's going on here? There's Palmer Big Rig Brewery, untapped. 3.4 out of 5 of 5,575 ratings. Um, this is an older can. We'll see if it's any good. Smells pumpkin-y. Ah, I, I wish it, I'm, I'm thinking maybe we can sell her this. Because it seems like there's nothing wrong with this. Wow, am I ever impressed. I'm actually impressed. To be honest, I'm impressed. There is nice head. Look at this. I thought this would have been a disaster. A disaster video. And there is no chunks at all that I could see in there. Nice upside down. Uh snowfall but you can't see it because it's uh, it's in the dark i can't believe it i'm looking there's no chunks on the bottom at all uh i can't i, I literally can't believe this this is quite fantastic guys fantastic i'm gonna do so next year i'm gonna uh, sell her one and i'm gonna do one fresh and see what happens because if you look right here i think you can see it Maybe. That's his, uh, it's really faint, but that's his uh, 020920, which would be September 2nd. All right, let's get into the smell. I, I'm, oh, oh, alcohol content. I forgot about alcohol content. 5.8% alcohol. Okay, guys, 5.8%, no IBU. Cool can, though. Cool can. And you know what? This is not the time to do pumpkin beers, but I sellered this one. The other ones weren't bad. This one, I, wow. Oh, nutmeg, cinnamon, pumpkin. I wish you guys can smell this. I I can't believe an eight month old pumpkin beer. I'm doing. I'm buying two next in in the fall, and selling it till for one full year next year. So next September I'm going to be. I, I can't believe. I'm I'm excited. 
I sellered this and I forgot about it. Well, I forgot about it, never sellered it. It's been in the, in the back of the fridge forever. All right, well, yeah. cheers and let's have a taste. It's totally perfect. It's totally perfect. I can't believe it. I, I, I want to cry. This is a quite good. I do get a little cola. I get a little bit of root beer. It's weird. And pumpkin, cinnamon, nutmeg. This is quite fantastic for a pumpkin porter. And I remember before that, I didn't really enjoy this one. But this is really, really good. And cellaring it, I think, has turned it even better. Man, nothing like, you know, May 25th, 2021, and this is really good. This is tasty, tasty, tasty. Big Rig Brewery, guys. I can't believe how good it is. I cellaring it. Now, it might not be as good right fresh, but I'm telling you, if you guys try something different, man, I'm telling you, I tried something different. Want to know how I tried something different? It's not trying a pumpkin beer because I love my pumpkin beers. I tried an eight-month-old. Uh, Tales from the Patch, Pumpkin Porter, eight month because I totally forgot about it. And then two weeks ago, I found it went, excuse me, found it went, oh my God, oh, did I ruin a beer? No, I created a beer. I created taste by cellaring it. And I'm telling you, buying two in September. And I'm going to do another review, visit, revisit it, uh, fresh. And then I'm going to do another review a year after, one year old, because this is only eight months. I believe you could probably sell this for 18 months. Ah, that's fantastic, guys. And do me a favor. You get this, and if I'll buy two, enjoy one. And put one away. Trust me. That's a solid eight. A solid eight out of ten, guys. And try something different. I'm telling you. I, I was kind of really iffy on doing this uh, review today. And I said, I'm glad I did it. And this is it, guys. I did. A I'm drinking a pumpkin beer. I'm drinking a pumpkin. I still have one more to do. And I might just not do that till September, while I buy another one. But try something different. Try a big rig. And this all glows in the dark. Uh, Tales from the pa patch pumpkin porter. Try something different. I can't express it enough. Like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow because. I'm going to go in the backyard in the heat and savor this porter. That's fantastic. I can't believe I did that. Uh, yeah, be kind to your neighbors. And I'll see you guys later. Cheers, everyone.